Does it, does it feel great doing this after being very physical in boxing? No. Why not? Because I want to keep getting fit. I don't want to be like like a massive downturn now the event's over. I want to keep up the fitness. And this is, I, I had a, great this time. Is a spectacular st step in the wrong direction. I had a great time drinking alcohol, being very unhealthy, watching Chris get punched. That, yeah. was, that was something I didn't know I needed yeah. in my life. Entertainment you can't buy. I was literally like, if Chris is here, I was sitting about this far away, Sipping my beer, watching Chris get punched <coughs> in the face. When I lost the Queen, I went to Connor. I went. Yeah, he looked, I fucked he, it. I don't know. I don't know if it got it on camera, but Chris went like this to me. Uh -huh. He went. <laughs> he did the same the commentary desk in the middle of the fight. He walked over. He's like, Oh really? Yeah. yeah. Like, Chris turned. I think you're supposed to be locked in. You're supposed to be focused. Well, you were looking at me, right? When you did that, right? You were just looking at the. Audience. Yeah, I looked okay. at Connor. And I thought he was looking at me. He just goes like this when he <laughs> threw his Queen. I thought I was dumb. How was the actual fight itself? How'd you feel? The fight, uh, I let myself down because he got an, a, a blow early on. And it really threw me off guard. I was like, oh shit, if he actually keeps So you had me. a plan going in, but then when you got hit. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody has a plan until they get. Uh, the, uh, the thing is, that was my first fight. I've done like that practice. Was definitely not his first fight, your opponent. No, no. But he seemed like a really nice guy. He took it really well. Did you see that like combat block he did from like fucking. He did something like this from like MMA. I didn't see that, no. Did this really weird block, and I was like, I don't know how to <laughs> attack that. Because most boxers do this or this, and he was like, yes. It looked really weird. I can't actually we, do it. We were talking about how he was walking around like a Dark Souls enemy because he was yeah, so yeah, slow yeah. and he had this arm always out ready to do an overhand. Yeah. He kept keeping, because obviously his wingspan is bigger than yours, he yeah. kept keeping you at a distance like yeah. this. So you could never really I get, couldn't get to him. Because obviously the moment you came in, he'd probably just smack you. I do think exactly. he figured out within the second round his overhand and yeah. how to block that. And so he tried it a few times and you blocked it every time. Yeah. Well, I, I dodged a really big hook. Yeah, yeah. one big hook. massive one. And I think I went under it or something and dodged it. But yeah, I would have liked to have hit him more in the face. Honestly, that was my biggest regret. And also losing the queen. But it's kind of a bittersweet thing. Mm. If I'd actually checkmated him as I intended to there and then, mm. it would have cut the whole thing in half. It would have been more boring. Yeah. It would have been like, oh, he's won, the end. Yeah. So by going light, right down to those last timer, to the clock, it made it so much more like edge of your seat. Also, and all the judges were like rigged, they're in my favour. They're all like, <laughs> come on Chris! It was so, everyone was so biased, I felt so sorry for my opponent, because everyone was like... Oh, like the commentary well, desk? He was, he was the, I guess I was the underdog. He, he was though. the favourite. Yeah, because right? when he came out, everyone was like, Chris is going to die. Oh yeah, the poll was I think 60... 70%. 70%, yeah, yeah, in his favour, so I think... I mean, after that, first, give up. after that first round, I was like, oh my god, I hope Chris wins in chess, because I, I thought I thought you were fucked. I came out of it and I turned to Nick, I went, I've got to win in chess, no, <laughs> I'm, I'm fucked. There's 300,000 people watching, and then you walk out, and everyone's like, yeah, Chris, ASO. <laughs> and then he walks out and they're like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening to my favorite time YouTuber? For, yeah, time for a broad in the body bag. Yeah.